example of a woman taken down by her heels. Her big tumble had all of us ladies wondering if there's any way to avoid falling in pumps. ABC's Amy Robach, who wears the highest heels I know, <laughs> is here to give us all some tips. I've never seen you even wobble. Well, that's just because no one's been looking, but oh, it's happened, that sidewalk crack. I think everyone who wears high heels, sometimes I can be wearing flats and stumble. Fortunately for me, I didn't have a camera following me the way the Australian Prime Minister did, but we did get some help from the very best in walking in high heels. Take a look. She may be a head of state, but it was Australian Prime Minister Julia Gillard's footwear that made headlines Wednesday. <laughs> this epic fall from grace, all because of the staple of a woman's wardrobe, the all too often hazardous high heel. If you uh, wear a heel, it can get embedded in soft grass. Uh, you know, the rest of it is uh, as you saw. Then again, who hasn't tottered, tripped, or tumbled when walking on these mini stilts from real life models to Sex in the City's Carrie Bradshaw? Oh my God, she's fashion roadkill. Lady Gaga, Beyonce, J Lo, and Rihanna all have taken a public plunge in their heels. I think women don't walk off the big toe properly. And so that makes your foot more unstable. The higher the heel, the more instability. So when in doubt, always lower your heel height. But what if you want to keep on stepping out in your six inch stilettos? Enter Miss J, the runway coach extraordinaire and seasoned judge on America's Next Top Model, gave me a lesson in how to avoid those footwear fiascos. Now, when you walk, do you walk on the balls of your feet or do you walk on the heels of your feet? I think I walk on the balls. You think? Is that bad? Clearly, I needed some help. What is the biggest mistake women make when they're walking in high heels? Is relying on the high heel to keep them steady. <laughs> You know, you have to navigate the shoe. Most of all, he says, even if you don't stick the landing, what really matters is how you react when you're back on your feet. Even if you fall, Fail. smile. If all else fails. <laughs> that looks so painful it so miss J gave me some good advice you okay. heard her a little bit so he he she said that you don't walk with the weight on the back of your heel because yeah. that's when it can go like this and yeah. fall we all have done that jungle. right okay. so you're supposed to walk on the ball like this oh. ladies follow oh. you're going forward like that oh. see oh <laughs> tiptoe, tiptoe, that tiptoe. That sounds the most natural. Maybe practical. not, but, if you, but he said always practice at home and practice on different surfaces. Carpets, uh, wood floors. Now I have to so practice that you walking know. too? Oh, come on. Oh, and chewing gum. And everything else? Mm -hmm. you know, Thank you so much, Amy. I have somebody that could probably teach us I how think to do so. that. Yeah, this lady. A pro. She can walk a catwalk like no other. Everybody. Victoria's Secret supermodel Alessandra Ambrosio. Yes. Oh. We are so happy to have you here and happy that you're going to share with us Victoria's Secret's brand new eye-popping creation. They've been doing these fantasy bras, you've probably heard of them, for 16 years. But this morning, we have an exclusive first look at their most stunning one yet. $2.5 million. million. dollars. Yeah. And Alessandra is here. Um, you've...